Dallas Baptist is the two seed in the Texas Tech Regional. Game one is Friday night against New Mexico. Head coach Dan Heefner joins me now. Coach, you win the Missouri Valley regular season and the conference title. You feel like you have just the right amount of momentum necessary heading into this regional? We do. We feel like we're playing well at just the right time. And um, I think the guys have been in a lot of pressure situations and did a great job in the conference tournament. So um, I like where we're at as a team right now. Last year you hosted a regional but were not able to advance to the Super Regionals. How much motivation is that providing for this year's team? Definitely motivating. I think the guys came in and, you know, that was a disappointment last year to get to host. Um, you know, we lost the first game, made it all the way back to the, the second championship game, um, lost a really close ball game. So that's for sure been on the guys' mind and um, they want to go further this year. What is the biggest difference between last year's very incredible run and this year's run that also has a lot of accomplishments? Um, two totally different teams. I mean, we were, we had a pretty loaded team last year. I mean, we had eight guys signed professional contracts, um, you know, three pitchers go in the top five rounds. We, we lost a whole lot of players off of that team to the draft and to graduation. So this year was a year where, you know, we had high expectations coming in just because we feel like that's where we're at as a program now, but um, also didn't know what was going to happen. So it's a, a very different team. Um, but it's been a great team, really fun team, very competitive, real close knit team. Um, and they've been great in close games, a lot of comeback wins. We had, you know, two walk off wins in our conference tournament. And that's kind of how they've done things all season long, you know, kind of a blue collar approach and fun team to watch. Now, coach, I know you've been uh, courted by other programs, especially last off season. Why is Dallas Baptist really home for you? Well, I've been here for nine years now as a head coach and to, you know, basically be there from the beginning when we were first transitioning to Division One and seeing what's happened with the program since then. Um, we've got phenomenal players in our program. It's a very unique place. Um, you know, what we get to do with our players, not only on the field, but off the field, you know, really investing them in their, you know, their character and their faith. They get a great education. It's a, it's a unique program, uh, but we also feel there's a, it, it's, it's an unfinished job with our program too. We feel like it's just on the upswing and We've got a ways to go, and last year was a huge step to host a regional, and you know we want to go further than that too. A lot of talented guys uh, for this Patriots team. I uh, want to talk about one pitcher in particular, uh, Colin Poche, Flower Mound Marcus guy, transfer from Arkansas. Tell me more about his story, how he wound up at Dallas Baptist, and what kind of guy is he off the diamond? Yeah, Colin was a, a high draft pick out of high school, chose to go to the University of Arkansas, got injured there, so he transferred to our place, sat out, redshirted last year. Um, and he has just slid right in, been our number one pitcher, you know, thrown Friday night all season long for us. And, you know, every time he's on the mound, you know, we've, our guys know we're going to win that game. Um, very competitive, uh, great teammate. Um, just, you know, like I said, when, when he's out there, he picks everybody else up and, you know, extremely disciplined, you know, left-handed guy with a good fastball that's deceptive. So um, he's a fun one to watch. And what is your approach in terms of picking the right pitchers in a regional format? Um, that's pretty easy. We're just going to stick with, you know, who's got us here. You know, Collins, our number one, our number two is very good. Derek Hall, um, also a first baseman for us, our cleanup hitter. So he's been a pretty neat story for us this year. And then our number three is a freshman from Birdville High School, Jordan Martinson, who's had an outstanding season as well. So we'll just stick with those guys. They've done a great job all season long. And uh, we've got a really strong bullpen again this year, too. So that's been a, a strength of the team. Dallas Baptist head coach Dan Heefner, safe travels out to Lubbock. Thank you. And I'm Edward E. Gross, Fox 4 Sports.